in the third paragraph. What did he do in the evenings last year? Oh, I'm sorry. It's actually in the fourth paragraph. Yes, it's in the fourth paragraph. Thank you. Last year, Jack worked very late. So he only had time for dinner and then go to bed yes. <laughs> early. Or, yeah. So last year, Jack worked late. So he only had dinner, then went to bed. <laughs> see if you have questions about this. What did, you, what did Jack do in the evenings last year? Last year, Jack worked late. So he only had dinner, then went to bed. So he didn't have time to watch TV or listen to the radio or go to parties. <laughs> he had dinner and went to bed, went to sleep. Does Jack ever go to a party? And how often? Does Jack go to a party? It's in uh, paragraph number two. So yeah, we know Jack does go to a party, yes. And how often does he go? Occasionally. So yes, occasionally. Jack goes to a party. Would you just put at the end? Goes to a party. Yeah. At somebody's. Does it say house or? Yeah, somebody's house. Somebody asked in a prior class, "What's the difference between a house and a home?" Usually people use it same, same, but a, a house is a building, a house. A home could, could be a building or it could be a tent or it could be a, what? An apartment building. It could be wherever you live, wherever you sleep. Um, I was trying to think of the idiom. A home is where you sleep. All right, so let's say this out loud. Yes. Let's say this occasionally. Yeah, that's a hard one. O K Shun 
A Lee. That's sort of how it sounds. That's how it sounds. Okay, Sean Ali. Right, occasionally. Occasionally. Five syllables. Occasionally. Okay. Does Jack get to work earlier than he did last year? You have to look at um, the first paragraph and then you look at the third paragraph. So this year, he gets to work this year. He gets to work to work at nine o'clock a.m. Last year, he got to work at eight o'clock. Last year, he got to work at 8 a.m. earlier. So the answer would be, does Jack get to work earlier than he did last year? No, he gets there later because 9 o'clock is later than 8 o'clock last year. So the answer is no. Does Jack get to work earlier? No. Jack gets to work later by one hour. Okay. So let's first say, let's get the information so we can answer the question. This year, paragraph number one, this year he gets to work at 9 a.m. Last year he got to work at 8 a.m. Got is past tense. So the answer is no, Jack gets to work later by one hour. He gets to work at 9 a.m. now, and he used to get to work at 8 a.m. before. Got to work, uh, he got to work one hour later by one, he got to work by one hour later. He got to work, or you could say he got to work at one hour later or by one hour later. How many hours a day did Jack work last year? This is a hard one because it's going to take some math, some arithmetic. Um, so let's put this up here. How many hours a day did Jack work last year? Last year, Jack worked from 
8 o'clock a.m. until, or 2, until 7 o'clock or 8 o'clock p.m. So to answer the question, how many hours a day did Jack work last year? So if we have a clock, so he worked from 8 a.m. Eight a.m. until almost eight p.m. So about if you work from eight a.m. until seven p.m., that's eleven hours. And 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. is 12 hours. So it's 8 to 9, 9 to 10, 10 to 11, 11 to 12, 12 to 13, 